I'm back. So, in my last video, I showed what's trending in this world through media. The example is the YouTube trending section. A lot of people view that. Fake space is trending. And a man that puts on women's makeup and dresses like a woman. They are popular. They have fame and fortune because of it. What they do is between them and God. But when it's an agenda, when it's the spirit behind this, I'm, that's what I'm always showing. Like these people, I want them to be saved. I want them to humble themselves before Jesus Christ. It's the truth that saves your eternal soul. Think about how long eternity is, you know? So Trixie Mattel, it's a man that dresses like a woman. They have fame and fortune because of it. They trend and are popular in media because of it. They have a whole bunch of eyeballs on their shirt there. Here they are doing one eye symbolism. They're doing the devil horns. They're doing the vow of silence. And so what I mean is, Sometimes it can be obvious like this, blaspheming Jesus Christ. Nothing else really needs to be said. I'm showing the spirit behind things that are popular in this world. Things that are, things and people that are pushed by the media. They bring in the Antichrist agendas. And Christians that want to stand up for our Lord Jesus Christ are hated because of it. It's a Halloween sale they're having. These are all things they post on their social media. You can get 666 off your order. Dealing with demons. Right? Like a lot of these, I don't need to say anything. They speak for themselves. This is not the truth of Jesus Christ. It's the opposite of that. They have the Freemason checkerboard. They're standing in front of the Freemason checkerboard. They wear, they're they wearing the Freemason checkerboard and it's behind them on the wall. They are wearing the Freemason checkerboard. It's the spirit of Antichrist. If people bring up the truth of Jesus Christ or, you know, the biblical world that we live in, People go, no, you're a conspiracy theorist, or that's crazy, they say. A lot of people say the word crazy. They say that because they don't understand. If they understood, I think they would have the fear of God in them, which is a good thing. It makes you humble yourself and walk with God and know that he's so important. He's all-powerful. He's not going to let this go on forever. Questioning God, if you have problems with God's rules and ways, which again, I've learned that they are beneficial for you. They're a way to live your life pleasingly for yourself and for God, who we should have a relationship with. Not ignore, not hate, not blaspheme, a real relationship. Everyone has a hole in themselves. They need to fill with that. You know, not something, not something gross. I hate to make a joke there, but everyone is missing something. You find that by having faith in Jesus, not for a day and then give up because you don't understand things or a miracle didn't happen in your life. Prayers aren't for things of this world, like I want some more toys or some more this or that. Everyone needs things to survive, right? And now I'm starting to rant because there's a lot of pop, there's a lot of important things to talk about. What I'm trying to show is that what trends in this world, it's antichrist. And you can see that with signs and symbols that are very clear to see now, even though they, they were hidden in plain sight the whole time. I didn't have faith most of my life, so I didn't see these things. And now it's very obvious the world is biblical. God bless you, everyone.